Soldiers from the Israeli Defense Forces, known as the IDF, visited Fort Benning, where soldiers provided insight into current and future training. Ah, and so you do it from the inside. Eh? What this allows us to do is really provide a great opportunity to share different innovations, uh, lessons, and ideas on how both the Israelis as well as we develop, train, educate our soldiers and leaders for this problem of future armed conflict. As Fort Benning soldiers sought to listen and learn from the IDF, they also shared lessons learned, showcasing different developments initiated at the Maneuver Center of Excellence. Different representatives from the Israeli Defense Forces are looking at a number of different training events that are going on here. Uh, primarily, one of their key interests is how we conduct multi-echelon training. As a result, we're showing them how we integrate the different training events in terms of both the infantry as well as the armor bullet training that's going on. Israeli soldiers not only saw live armor exercises, they experienced state-of-the-art simulation training, events that will help them in advanced leadership development and provide us the feedback necessary for future innovation. Well, that's the next gener generation of training. We have in each core, uh, infantry, armored, artillery, and now in our core, in the combat collection core, simulators in order to supervise the training better. The combination of simulators as well as today's boots on the ground training was a welcome sight for the IDF. There is nothing like feeling the dirt, to sweat in the field, to crawl, and so on. Simulators are good for the technique, but fighting is in the battlefield. This exchange of information not only strengthens the relationship between the IDF and the United States, it also allows each military the opportunity to train and educate their soldiers for the future. Melissa Bell, Fort Benning TV.